Hi guys, so today we are working on a 24 by 24 inch canvas. Um, so I'm just doing one thing here. I have a ton of leftover paints that I want to use up and go from there. But I gotta wake some of them up too. They've been sitting for quite some time now. But I have metallic sapphire, I have bright aqua green, I have a turquoisey color here. I have Pebeo's iridescent green blue, Bordeaux red, anthroquinone blue, Prussian green, cobalt blue, nickel azo gold, some gold here. And then I have this little piggy TLP deja vu mixed with another color and I can't remember where it is. It was here. I don't know where it went, but anyways, so we are going to play with these colors. I actually have a little bit of Pebeo's iridescent blue black. I've got some white here also. Yeah. So you get the gist. We've got a lot of colors to play with. So we are just going to throw it on down on the canvas and, uh, do a galaxy style straight pour or something we'll see i have no idea but i think that's what we'll go for either way all right we'll just use some of this white some of pebeo's blue green anthroquinone blue and And some green. Let's come in with the, that's not deja vu, I'm sorry, that's violet rain. And then some white. I'm gonna come in with the Bordeaux red by Arteza. And then some gold, Nicolazzo gold. Come in with some white. Yes. I guess we didn't use all of the colors. This here will be my edges. We didn't use all the colors that I thought I would, but that's all right. We got rid of some. And ready, set, go. Dang rabbit. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. And we're gonna fix that right here. Now I will say, it's always known that leftover paints are better to paint with. And uh, from the look of this, that is the case. Now I am a little concerned with this area here. I'm not very happy about that. It looks very muddy. And I'm just putting the flow extender around the puddle because I do not want the puddle to be rolling over itself any more than it already is. All right, I'm gonna bring you guys in, so 
part in the ruffling of the okay look at this puddle trying to get you guys in there a bit more there we go look at all those lines like this area here yeah all right so we're gonna just bring you guys back around. All right, so this cup is super pretty. Um, so I'm definitely gonna hold on to that. Now we're gonna give it a torch. It's like killer in here. I don't know. It's been a while since I've seen a pour come out like that, as beautiful as it is. So we are definitely going to take our time. I'm going to need more flow extender for sure. Just love everything. Almost put my finger in it. That would have been awful. All right. So I think what we're going to do. Just kind of move it around, bring it back up to there. Just enough to push a little bit of the flow extender off. See where the that'll bring it back a little bit. I'm gonna nurse this bad boy because. Come up to that corner again. And come over here.
I come down this way. I actually want to go back to the middle a little bit. Just trying to move the weight of the paint so that it doesn't screw up any or too much of the composition. This way again. So I'm actually going to leave it right there. one of these things, but today we are going to. just didn't want to lose all of that red and violet rain mixture I got going on. Come down to this corner now. I know you guys may not be able to see, but Love what's going on over here. So let's try, let's just turn this, it'll help. some of what I got going on here, but it might be okay. I'm actually going to leave it like this and I have leftover paint in my cup that I'm going to do to fix the corners. So 
So we are gonna bring you guys in in just a few minutes. Alrighty. Okay, so here are the final results. I just love what's going on here. Love all these cute cells. And then when you get over here, the purple and the colors are just beautiful. And I love all these lines. It's like sliced agate. And that looks super dark. So I hope it's not dark. Anywho, this is the final result. It's very cool. I like it. So you guys have a wonderful day and uh, check out my auction for tonight. Bye.